Good morning, everyone. It's a beautiful day today. We are packing a small luggage right here and we're leaving for Uluwatu, which is like an hour and a half from where we live to just spend the night somewhere else and enjoy the scenery there. Like the beaches are a little bit more pretty than around here. Not more pretty, but it's like white sand and everything. So it's nice to kind of change the scenery. And I'm taking you guys with me for the weekend so you can see a little bit where we're staying, where we eat, and what we did, which is pretty new for me because I haven't been there in like three to four years. So I'm happy to see what's the vibe there. So let's do outfit of the day. Little top, jewelry, sandals, linen shorts. Comfortable and cute. My hair is a little crazy. My boyfriend has a bag as if he's leaving for five days. And I have a mini bag. So whoever says women overpack, liars. You ready? This is the bedroom. I mean, these curtains are just, it's funny how like the simple things can make a place so beautiful. And then you have access to this nice balcony here on the beach. I'll take you to the bathroom. Cool concrete bathroom. So 
so happy to be here. It's beautiful. Look at this bed. And let's check out the view of the bed. Ooh, that's nice. I can't wait to like watch the sunset and wake up tomorrow morning here. Even though I think it's gonna be super bright. I don't see any like blinds to make this very dark. So I guess we'll just wake up with the sun. Um, now we're gonna go have lunch on the beach and I'm gonna take you guys with me. And we don't know where we're going, we're just gonna wing it. Definitely, if you come to this Airbnb, do not bring a big luggage, just a small bag because you will hate yourself having to go up and down the stairs with it. <laughs> and we're now gonna go catch the sunset and have some dinner. We had a nice day at the beach. And that's it. I come. to rent a scooter. <laughs> Good morning guys. Um, we've just had breakfast downstairs. Anyway, uh, we had a long night because you can really hear like the sound of the waves which sounds soothing but for some reason it kind of keeps you from sleeping and then it started raining so much and that made a lot of noise so we woke up around 6 30 and i actually woke up and i was what time is it and he's like 6 30 but i heard 10 30 and i was like okay i'm so tired but i have to get up and then i take my phone and i'm like oh it's almost 6 30 i can go back to sleep so I went back to sleep and then woke up at 9 and yeah, we had breakfast and now we're just going to get ready to have a nice walk on the beach and then check out. And then we'll just, I don't know, like maybe stay at the beach, have lunch and then go back home. Anyway, yesterday I didn't film our dinner but we, we were in a really, really nice restaurant that I'll link down below. Um, this place was really pretty and the food was really good so definitely recommend. And yeah, all right, outfit change. I put on a bikini top and I'm just going to do my routine. I cleansed and put my moisturizer. As I, you know, I whenever I travel like this, I want to travel light. So the one product that I have is this because it cleanse and it moisturize. So I use that and then I have my little moisturizer that I can't live without. And then my super group 50 SPF. Same thing, can't live without. So yesterday I stopped filming when we were entering a garden. So we were looking to rent a scooter and there was none available near our hotel. So someone told us, oh, you know, not far from here, there's someone that rents one. So we went there, we walked and we arrived. He's like, yeah, come inside of my garden. Like, okay, so we started entering. And then his dog that had such a mean face, and I love dogs, but this one had a really mean face, started coming up at us and, he, and barking like in a very intense way and his owner was not doing anything and he was like walking and the dog was going faster than him towards us and I was like, this is scary and we're in his home so I don't know like, 
what he's about to do, but that was, and so I couldn't film, I was like sweating <laughs> of heat, I knew that I was scared. But this guy was so sweet because he didn't know us, he didn't ask for any like type of ID or something that we could trade, so he made sure we would come back. He's like, yeah, come back tomorrow, you'll just give it back tomorrow. He has no idea when we'll give it back to him, but I guess he trusted us. Um, which is pretty nice, you know, it's so, so like unusual, I guess, nowadays to have someone be like, yeah, just rent it, and I hope you guys will be back tomorrow. <laughs> So unusual, but it's it's pretty different. It's a different way of doing, and I kind of enjoy it. Being responsible of being a good person, you know, and kind of trusting strangers to act the right way is pretty beautiful. Just a little bit of concealer. I must say, I can't live without concealer. And when I go to the beach, you know. Hurt. <laughs> Put on a little bit. Would I recommend staying in this Airbnb? Airbnb, I don't know. Whatever. Um, more than a night? No. Because you do like privacy. I don't know why I did this kind of shared balcony. It's kind of a pity because right now there's like a girl taking pictures in front of my bedroom window, and I'm like, hi, I'm half naked. <laughs> okay so yeah it's a pretty place to see and take beautiful pictures it's really stunning but it's not the best if you're looking for a romantic getaway i'd say <laughs> waking up in the morning and kind of having people walking in front of your window it's but definitely this place where we're staying thinking beach and uluwatu is very very nice it's very different from like where we live and you know Chonggu and all of that it's super super different so it's a little bit more mellow there's less you know traffic and cars and things like that it's a bit more chill and the beaches are beautiful because the beaches near our house are like black sand beaches whereas here it's white sand so it's very different the color of the water is super blue it's, it's a different vibe you know and kind of so yeah, if you ever come to Bali, it's definitely a must do. Like I, we like to come here once in a while on weekends, kind of get away and see something different. Um, but if you're here on vacation, it's definitely a place you have to see. And also something I didn't film is the way down yesterday. We came back, so you know that way up and way down that we did that I kind of film. Um, we had to do that in the dark and then walk on the beach at night with the sea kind of crashing on the beach. It's kind of frightening. I was fine because I was with my boyfriend. I would have not wanted to do that alone. <laughs> so yeah, you need to take that into account if you stay here on the beach. There's a lot of stairs to go down, a lot of stairs to go up. It's a good 10 minutes of like walking up and walking down. And you're, you have to sometimes cross on the beach, so at night it's not like an easy way to get home. No, because I, I, I would know that people sometimes travel with a lot of luggage and maybe it's not the best place to stay on the beach. There are other hotels that are a little easier to access that I think is best if you have a lot of heavy luggage. I overpacked. <laughs> I'm packing to check out. And I have five pieces that I'm never gonna wear because we're leaving. And I'm like, why did I even pack them? Where do I think that I was going? With two dresses, two tops, three shorts. <laughs> it's just insane. Um, you know what? I didn't show you guys the view. No view for you, because I can't I can't open the door. <laughs> it's too hard for me. So this is what it looks like. So see, this is the shared balcony I was talking about. But yeah, it's pretty beautiful. The beaches are stunning. Beach time. We are going on a rest in a restaurant that's on the beach where they serve like super fresh fish. 
can't wait. Change of plans. He went surfing, so I'm having a nice coconut on the beach. Beach time. And I hope to get a little bit of a tan. And that's it. And then we'll have lunch in the fish restaurant I was talking about. But he didn't want to miss the, the moment to go surfing, which is fine with me. I love chilling at the beach. Made it up the stairs. We just left the hotel, had lunch. It's a nice day. We're now heading back, getting a car, and going to get a massage. Um, and that's the end of the vlog, actually, because it's Sunday, it's Sunday night, and we're on for a new week. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, comment down below if there's anything else you guys would want to see. Uh, like, and of course, subscribe if you want to see more. Um, all right, guys, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.